evening, everybody. This is Chris speaking, CCTV, Night Watchman. The other day, I was listening to Sid Roth, and he had uh, Roger Stone on, and he was saying there's a portal over the White House area, and it's demonic. And so I did a little investigation, and this is what I come up with. that, that a, a portal, a demonic portal, opened above the White House around the time that the Bidens moved in. Uh, this was brought to my attention by a, a Christian who lives in North Florida who sent me a bunch of photographs uh, and a bunch of documents and also some notations in, in, the, in the Bible about portals. As that that a, a portal, a demonic portal, opened above the White House around the time that the Bidens moved in. Uh, this was brought to my attention by a, a Christian who lives in North Florida who sent me a bunch of photographs uh, and a bunch of documents and also some notations in, in, the, in the Bible about port photos. And, I, and you, you can also, there's a live cam where you can actually see in real time and there does appear to be something, you know, above the White House. Something, something must, inexplicable. Well, at first you say, well, maybe it's a reflection. Or maybe it's a, an aerostat balloon you know, maybe there's a logical, so I, I called a police officer I know, works in Arlington, he's a friend of mine, and I said, look, um, do me a favor, would you go down and check this out? He said, are you out of your mind? I said, no, just, just humor me, just humor me. Go down there and, and check it out and tell me what, call me back and tell me what you see. Right. And he called me back about two and a half hours later and he said, you're not going to believe this, but there's definitely something there. And it's there, he said, it, people who, are, other people were there photographing it. One man called me and said, you can see it day or night. It's, a, it's like a smudge in the sky, almost like a cloud that doesn't move. But when you zoom in on it with a telephonic lens, it's swirling like a... Take two. Okay, you've heard what Roger said about the... Um the orb that it was swirling and so far before you get there i'll just tell you the end of the story from the beginning the bottom one is an it's got energy coming out of it the top one looks like it could be transparent um could be an illusion it could be a cgi in the sky um but i thoroughly investigated it and i did it up to 5k 13k 12k and uh, the bottom one is a hot object which has energy, light source energy coming from it. With the tool I used, a forensic tool, you'll see what I'm talking about. Um, don't know why there's not jets, you know, flying around this thing. Um, but this is my take on it. Um, my opinion is neutral on this, this point because I see a lot of stuff. I didn't believe in UFOs, but I do now. Um, and unidentified flying objects doesn't mean they're extraterrestrial. If it's extraterrestrial, it's fallen angels. That's how I believe. And so I rebuke this thing, whatever it is. Get out of the skies of Washington. You overlords or whatever you are. Principalities, powers of spiritual wickedness. I bind your activity right now in Jesus' mighty name. So there you go. I'll be back.
So I snagged the picture as a snapshot after I filmed it live myself. Right now I'm just doing some filtering. And I want to see what these objects are. Because they're still there. They're pretty much saying Roger Stone's lost his mind. But as you can see, we got two objects. Now if anybody knows my channel, um... 2020, I think, or 20, yeah, 2020, over Halls, uh, Massachusetts, an object like this opened up, and I don't know to this day if it's still there, but I went back a few times, but this is really something in the air, and, uh, you know, they were saying it's a portal opened up, and I've been looking for planets and portals for five or six years now, so... There's definitely something there. Amazing. Anybody got a clue? Definitely demonic. You know, but a lot of times it could just be, from what we're finding out, a sun simulator, a couple, a couple devices making that, bring hysteria on what's going on, feeling of confusion and uh, left out of a loop of what's really happening that's a real object and it's really there let's see it's gonna both take the bring the exposure all the way up full light that's gonna be one two huge ships right there anyway i thought you guys needed to know that and i figured i'd show it to you that's over the white house sure Here's the actual channel. Through the White House. And saying that <clears throat> this portal opened up. There's a live feed on it right here, friends. It's saying this portal opened up when Biden got in the office. And uh, it's right there. Two objects watching over him. Um. All angel stuff going on, and uh, that, that's not man made on the ground up. I don't believe I think that's things right up in the sky. Okay, I'm in my little um, forensic tool, it's late night here, and uh, I should have followed up on this a couple of days ago. But I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna start out with the magnifier to show you these objects there. Um, you know, Roger Stone was talking about them being portals. And I'm looking at them at, at them as ships or some type of ships, demonic ships. I don't know. <clears throat> but on this uh, little program I have here, just auto contrast, that's what you see. Two objects, right? Now, if I put an auto contrast by color, it'll separate what color is what. That one's actually yellow. So it's got an energy source. This one is red. You notice the boxes. Okay. Now, I take this thing called level sweep. Okay. And I'm going to start adjusting it. Bringing the opacity up. You're going to see if it's really here or not. We can still look at it. See, that's, that's my little magnifier glass. This brings it up to about 13 or 14K. This picture is about 5K. There's two objects right there. Okay, now I'll, I'll show you their objects. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, I did this before. I was sitting there playing around. I said, yeah, there's something there. There's something there, folks. That's what you're really looking at, two objects. So if anybody's been studying this or watching it, I hope you get to see this. I was going to do this a couple days ago. I just put it off. But here it is. There is two objects in the sky. As I bring the opacity down, it's more like what you saw right there at the cam. But you can still pick it up with this device. Okay, that's, that was called level sweep. Now there's another, there's another little tool here, it's called Luminous, and uh, 
Luminous, what it does is it's got a topical map of whatever you're looking at. It will basically outline it. As they bring the opacity up, okay, see these objects there. This does like a topical map on it. Bottom one to me from using this device compared to the top one with all the squares. The top one might be a hologram, the same, or a portal. The smaller one should actually be opening up the portal. Just, you know, make it out loud, guys. Now, as I bring the opacity up, it picks up all the light sources, the different building outlines. So everything that's real, the buildings, the trees, the lights, everything. Same here. It's really there. It's not some camera illusion. Okay, so it's pretty intense. There you go, it's intense right there. There's your item. And I would say the big red one is like, um, kind of like spiritual or something. It's a portal. It's opened. We close that in the name of Jesus. We command it to be shut. We catch the enemy right now. We shut down that thing, which is letting in demonic activity into the White House. Super intense right there, so it's called super intense. is showing all the lights look the same, everything that looks the same. I'm more interested in up here, what's in the sky up there.
Anyways, there don't seem to be nothing going on. We'll quantize it, see what happens. Back to the magnifier. So that's what you're looking at, guys. It's the clearest shot I can give you. This one I already. It's 5K. So, you chart with a 5K shot. Definitely objects there. Oh. That bottom has got some heat on it. That bottom has got heat. Heat signature on it. Top one I think is a reflection from the bottom one. Yeah, I'm just kind of showing you guys how real this thing is. Now, if you remember, in Halls, uh, Massachusetts, we caught this for two nights. They shut my live feed down because of it. Um, we caught something similar. We've seen crafts come out of it, everything. I probably have 500 people watching it, and all of a sudden, I went down. <laughs> Censored. Anyways, this is what I do. Forensic show. And so if you were wondering if that was real or not, if it's a real portal, if it's a real ship, if it's a real moon, if it's a real planet, you tell me. It's real. And the luminous is the one that is the dead giveaway. Because the luminous picks, picks up the, uh, here you go, inverted. Thank you. 